In this video, we take a high-level look at Vantage Analytics Library and the four categories of functions. Those functions are descriptive statistics, variable transformation, statistical test, and analytic algorithms and scoring. Descriptive statistics helps you better understand your data by calculating totals, counts, averages, minimums, and maximums, null values, blanks, standard deviations, skewness, and many more. This is the customer's table that is installed with Vantage Analytics Library. For each customer, we have income, age, gender, marital status, years with the bank, and more. We will use the values analysis to calculate common descriptive statistics. We can see column types, total counts, number of nulls, number of unique values, blanks, and more. This describes our data and will help with variable transformation decisions. Next, we use Vartran the variable transformation function in Vantage Analytics Library. We will take gender from a categorical M slash F column to two new integer columns with design code, also known as one hot encoding. We will replace nulls in the postal code column with zeros and scale the age column to a one to 10 scale. In the hypothesis testing, we will combine customer account and transaction tables into an analytic data set. Let's look at checking and savings average balances. A binomial test can indicate how related our balances are based on a 50% probability of the test occurring. And here we see the null hypothesis, which as they are not related, is true. In analytic algorithms and scoring, let's use our analytic data set based on our three tables. We want to predict credit card average balances based on our other variables using linear regression. This creates the model Linear Regression Demo 1. In scoring, we use the model created earlier and score and evaluate the model, also retaining the actual credit card average balance. Here is the scoring output with the function's estimate and the actual balances to compare. In this video, we discuss Vantage Analytics Library and the four categories of functions.